This is privet. This is also an SPP. There are several of them that have escaped in different parts of the country. Uh, this technically is probably what we call border privet. Uh, you, again, you don't need to worry about that. Now these weren't like a conservation plant. These were extremely popular uh, ornamental in the 50s and 60s. Every house in my neighborhood had privet hedges. We, you're like, hedges with this ugly thing? If you prune it, it gets very dense. You can make a wall. We, our, our yard had a wall, like six foot tall, one foot wide, literally living wall. You had to trim it that way. You can make meatball shapes out of them, swans, baskets, topiary. Edward Scissors. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that, this was very common. Now, I don't even think you could buy one. If you went to a nursery, they'd be like, what? And then even rare things will say, well, what we'll order you one? This, they'd probably go, I don't know where I, I can't get you that. I don't think anybody's producing this uh, because it's just not used. It's all out and escaped and running through the woods now. Uh, now, it's very, very opposite. Mm -hmm. What does that make it look like and looking like and sounding like? Black hog. Yeah. It almost has the same little fish skeleton look in places, but these are very, very thin. This would be a fine boned fish. They're not evergreen, but they're tardily deciduous. That's actually a term, meaning they come off very late. Like even when we teach this in the winter, there's, there's some leaves left. There'll be less and less ever as weeks go by, but there'll still be some green leaves out here next March uh, after the winter we have. And uh, Blackhawk, they're gone. Uh, another real good difference is the fruits. We have a lot of fruits this year. Uh, they're about the size of a BB. Same color as Black Hawk, dark navy blue, uh, but much, much smaller, tighter cluster. It's a big cluster, but they're, they're tight. So again, way, way, way smaller. And I think another good difference is the bark stays smooth. What does Black Hawk bark do? Small dogwood, like dogwood quartered up again, small cubes. This stays smooth. It gets spec. It gets lenticels, like little, just like little dots, but not to where it would make it like rough with lenticels. It's still smooth with lenticels. 